Please start. Padma, please start. Okay. Hello, my dear kids. Very good evening. This is Sundar Ravindranath here. Hey guys, how is everybody? What's up? Exam time, right? Exams are nearing. So that's why we are starting with all the revision. It was a wonderful session today, guys. So with uh, Vijay Tapa, uh, you know what? So in case you have not you you have not enrolled, please enroll into that. probably you know we can't give you a lot of time the batch itself will be for only you know somewhere like 10 days or so right lucky hi let me see who are all here sanskriti hi hi yona ma'am or sir <laughs> sundar oh great great utar utkarsh hope this is going to be useful for you Facts for Nitesh. So, guys, what are we going to do today? Mind map session on human environment, right? Different types of environment. We have the delta regions. We have the basins like Amazon river basins. All right, how you know the tropical and the subtropical regions? What's happening there? All right, how do people live? And that's this beautiful chapter about. We have completed the chapter. Today will be a revision and a mind map session on that. Cool. Arya Deshmukh, hi. Welcome to Vedanta Young Wonders. Doraemon says, "Sir, sir, please start. You know, let's not wait anymore." Okay, for anything for him, let's start. So Suresh is saying, "Sir, what can we do today?" Look at that, guys. Vijayta, right? Patch is coming with a ten percent discount. All your favorite. Young wonders teachers in one place. Would you believe that? So please make use of it. All the best. So six to eight final revision batch is happening. Vijayta, right? So you will have tips and tricks, in-class doubt solving. The base price, you know, price is seven hundred rupees. A ten percent discount you are eligible for. You will see a blue color link pasted there in your description box. Click on that link. Okay, to enroll into the course. All the best. Oh, Swaraj, hi. I remember you didn't talk much at all there. Yeah. <laughs> welcome, welcome. I hope you enjoyed the session. Deepika, come on. At your age, if you're saying, "Sir, I'm so bored," at my age, what will I say? Come on, guys. Enjoy life. Very important it is. Don't say it's boring and all. It is. Well, go out and look at the sky. You will never feel bored. Look at the plants. Look at people around you. Don't speak. Just listen. All right. You will learn a lot of stuff. Okay. Cool. So now, Doraemon Musi. So what is English? Hindi English. I speak. I take it in English. Few teachers take in Hindi. All right so that's why they have put it like english so the batch starts today by the way so don't miss it all the best looking forward to teach you there 
Guys, what is Vedantu Young Wonders? There are a few who are new, right? So Young Wonders is all about 6th, 7th and 8th grade students. Complete academic support. Alright? And non-academically, lovely, lovely stuff. Whatever you are looking for, it will be there. Academically, Math, Science, Social and English. Entire year syllabus we cover. Now we are starting. Guys, you will see after 27, once Vijeta is over, immediately we will start Pariksha. So, be all there, right? Subscribe to the channel, enable the bell icon, wait for our notifications. Cool? Hi, Divya Bharti. Hi. So, have you subscribed? In case you have not, please do it. Already there, we are a big family of more than half a million subscribers. All right? We would love to see you a part of our family. So, subscribe, enable the bell icon, hit the like button if you want to. Right. Last session. <clears throat> Thank you, Ritika. Last session, we, I gave you a riddle, right? Take off my skin and I won't cry, but you will. What am I? Everyone knows this, right? So simple. Yeah, Ritika is saying, onion, onion, onion. Yes, Ritika, you're bang on. It is onion, right? Everyone, I'm sure many of you would have got this, right? So simple. First few to answer. Pawan, Rinku, Manav, and Krigu. Congratulations, good job done. That's the kind of swiftness that we need. Keep it up, all of you. Oh, great Paramesh, great, great, great. Fun fact. <clears throat> Let's go with the fun fact. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. What is so special? This small sentence has all the English alphabets. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. All 26 alphabets of English will be there. Yeah. Advik, you better. The quick brown fox over, jumps over the lazy dog. That uses this sentence as every letter of the English alphabet. Cool? Cool. Time to start the session. Who is that? W is not there. Brown W is not there. W is always there. So let's start the revision. Human environment, tropical, subtropical regions. So you, you take the equator. We know where the equator is, right? The Amazon River. We have the earth divided into half. The center line, you know, the line dividing the earth into half. There you call that as an equator. The Amazon river basin lies near the equator, right? So it covers certain portions of Brazil, all right, parts of Peru, Bolivia, Equator, Colombia, and Venezuela a little. So now, what kind of climate is there in Amazon basin? So we spoke about two, two, you know, in this particular chapter, we spoke about two regions. One is Amazon basin, all right, typically South America, right? Brazil and stuff, South America. On the other side, what is the other region that we spoke about? Anyone remembers? Hi, Unati. What is the other region that we spoke about? Wow, Ganga. Apart, it's just Ganga or something else. Ganga Brahmaputra region. Yes, Ritika, bang on. So, let's start with Amazon. Amazon has a hot and a wet climate. Guys, all of us know forest needs a lot of rain. And of course, a lot of sunlight as well. Both. Right. So, hot and a wet climate Amazon has. The rainforest is, this Amazon rainforest is one of the richest with respect to plants and animals. Flora and fauna. A variety of birds, monkeys, sloth. You, you know, people, frankly speaking, they accurately cannot, do not know how many species are there. So many millions of species are there in the Amazon River Basin. So, cool. 
reptiles, snakes, anteaters, tapirs, so many. So what kind of ag people living there, you know, the tribals and all, you will always see they do slash and burn agriculture in these forests. What they do, they locate a place in the forest, cut down all the trees, burn those trees, use their ashes as manure and do the cultivation for agriculture there. It's called slash and burn agriculture. Locate a place, cut the tree, burn the tree, use the ashes as manure. Cool? So now if you take Ganga and Brahmaputra basin, alright, that's one of the largest in the world. Alright, that, that region, the delta. So the plains, alright, of Ganga, Brahmaputra, the mountains and foothills of Himalayas and the Sundarban delta, this region forms the main area of the Ganga Brahmaputra basin. Right. So where? The foothills, the mountains and the foothills of the Himalayas and the Sundarbans Delta. These two form the major area of the basin, Ganga Brahmaputra basin. So what kind of trees grow here? Tropical deciduous trees. Okay, in the Ganga Brahmaputra basin. Ripunjai, you have to wait. He just started. Come on. So guys, look at that. The Ganga and Brahmaputra rivers, they possess, they form the largest delta in the world. I think I already spoke about it. What is a delta? First of all, what is a delta region? Come on, come on, come on. Hi, Jasmita. Yes, anacondas are there. <coughs> All right, typically the river side, you know, the river, the, the area, regions along the river side, the delta regions, right? That is the largest, Ganga Brahmaputra is the largest delta in the world. L rich in wildlife, a variety of fish is also found here. Hello, Jyoti. Doramon, no comments, I don't know. But I have seen, you know, anaconda uh, are there, definitely. These are live snakes only, you know, they are, it's not um, uh, created, that movie was not created out of a myth. Something that is actually there is what they did, but they showed it to, you know, a very, very huge size, frankly. So look at that, in the Ganga Brahmaputra plains, you have areas like Allahabad, Kanpur, Varanasi, Lucknow, Patna and Kolkata. So these cities are located, that is the reason these cities are so fertile and flourishing. And obviously like Varanasi, tourism is also an important activity of this place in the basin. <clears throat> so guys, are you clear till this? Amazon, hot and wet climate, largest one, you know, with respect to the kind of flora and fauna and uh, Typically, it forms, uh, you know, a lot of uh, places in, you know, countries in South America. Coming to Ganga Brahmaputra, largest delta region in the world. All right, very, very fertile, very rich in uh, wildlife. Okay, and it forms this, this plain, Ganga Brahmaputra basin plain. They have very, very noticeable cities like Allahabad, Kanpur, Varanasi, Lucknow, Patna, Kolkata, etc. So, tourism is also a very important area. Tell this, are you clear? Ashley, why? Why you want to see that before Sundarban? This slide. Kushmeth, hi. Slash and burn agriculture. Cool? I hope you are done now. Okay. So, guys. Are you clear? Till this. All clear. Hi Swaraj. Oh, you're Swaraj. Okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Hi Mahi. Right. So, guys, our crash course is still open. What is so special about Vedantu's crash course? I will tell you. It is summed up beautifully here. Doubts, concept clarities, questions, assignments, 
syllabus, revision plan, etc. Right? So, guys, welcome to Vedantu's live interactive course. Right now, you are almost like nearing your exams. Only a few weeks left. Perfect time to take this up because we cover revision for entire syllabus. Great teachers who will make things simple and real, real fun. You will never forget it. And we know how to fast track within the given time. Batch has just started two, three days ago. Please make use of it. You can, you know, download the entire notes. We give you a lot of notes, right? In the class, you can download everything. Get all your doubts instantly solved, right? Inside the class, all your doubts will be solved for you. All right, so exam time, perfect time to take this up. Hi, Geetha Shri, hi. Manju, thank you for helping. <laughs> assignments, look at that. You, we make you write a lot of assignments. This there, even in Vijeta. We give you a lot of assignments. We make you write them so that <clears throat> you will never forget. The more you write. Like tests. The more tests you write, you will never have exam fear. Correct. We give you a lot of mock tests. So that you master the question paper along with you get rid of exam fear. So small, small concept toy courses, micro courses completely free for you. Make use of it guys. 6th, 7th, 8th ka crash course. Alright, there will be a link pinged to your description box. vdnt.in slash ytpro. The link is vdnt.in slash ytpro. For people who are new, I'm telling you. If at all you're thinking so 6 subjects, it's going to be very costly because the entire syllabus is being revised. So many features are there. Look at that. 800 rupees math, physics, chemistry, biology, English and social in Vedantu with recordings, live classes, tests, assignments, doubt solving inside the class. That is the first subscription light. Along with the sub features of light, if you want doubt solving outside the class through a mobile app, right? That's classic. So classic will have doubt solving inside and outside the class. 800 rupees and 1000 rupees. Hi Ayush. Yeah. So you see an apply coupon at the bottom. Click on apply coupon. Type SRPRO. 800 becomes 720. Wow. Similarly for classic, 1000 becomes 900. Please make use of it guys. All the best. The batch just started on 14th. It's been only two days. Why 15, 16, 17? Three days. Right? So, all the best. Looking forward to seeing all of you in Vedantu. So, the link is vdnt.in slash ytpro. It will be pinned. Don't worry. After the class, you will see that the link will be pinned. The coupon code to get the discount. What I spoke about is SRPRO. Cool, guys. Here is the mind map for the chapter Human Environment Interactions Tropical Subtropical. So typically, primarily you see the mind map divides the chapter into five segments. Ganga Brahmaputra Basin, what, how is life? How is life in the Amazon Basin? Two things. Similarly, climb, when we speak about uh, Amazon Basin, climate of Amazon Basin, rainforest and people of the rainforest. Five sections. Right. So when we speak about the life in the Ganga Brahmaputra region, you should know what is the climate regarding the topography. Right. What kind of forest, you know, vegetation is there. What kind of wildlife is there. When we speak about these basins, these are areas which that you should think about. You should divide it into and remember. So if you take a basin, Ganga Brahmaputra, height, topography, Vegetation, the forest, wildlife, what kind of cities are there covered in the basin, right? Tourism, how do people, you know, survive there? What is the major source to is tourism there, etc. Cool. On the other side, if you take life in the Amazon basin, okay, how is that? What kind of climate is there? Hot and wet, right? So, does it rain there? How often? What is the temperature average? The climate part. So, what kind of forests grow there? Same thing in both the basins. 
Hi Ayush. Many many happy returns of the debate. God bless you, beta. So guys, are you clear? Everyone. So come on, come on, come on, guys. If you are clear, right? So typically, both the basins form the tropical subtropical regions. One is in South America, one is in the Indian subcontinent, right? So uh, how is life? Flora, fauna, climate, right? Towns and cities, if any. Correct. This is how you need to divide the chapter and remember. Guys, if everyone is clear, give me a yo. Come on, hit the like button also, so that I start with the next section, Menti. Ripunjai, birthday for you as well. Super, happy birthday. God bless you. Kalash, only yo is enough. <laughs> okay, cool. Let us jump into Menti now. So guys, I want all of you to open life. Oh, okay, okay, sorry. Note it down, note it down. Kusmet, please note it down now. I hope it is clear now. Yeah. Aradhya, hi. Okay, again I'm coming back. So guys, please open a separate browser window. Type www.menti.com. M-E-N-T-I, menti.com. And type this code 72776015. 72776015. Great, great Kalash, no problem. Hi Aparna. So go to the website menti.com. It will say please enter the code, type this code 72776015. GK King, your network is low. Palak, thank you. Right, time to get into a mentee. Come on, come on, come on, guys. Not much time left. Faster, faster, faster. Adwik says, sir, Adwik, that is something that I am uh, supposed to ask you guys. You are asking me to say yo. Okay, 30 more seconds. First question is going to hit your screen. So be ready. Come on, come on, come on. 15 more seconds. So here we go. The quest will start in five, four, three, Two, one, first question on your screens now. And the question is, how is the climate of in, you know, in the Amazon basin, guys? It's like 
cold and wet, hot and wet, dry and wet, or dry or wet, or none of this. Climate of the Amazon Basin. Hot and wet. Almost all of you got this right. So one question done. The leaderboard is saying Amarnath is at the top followed by Krigu, Vanshika, Sampurna, Priyansh. Top 5. Priyansh, you are in grade 4. Okay. Bhavesh, Vanshika, Shaurya, Adit and Divyanshu. Yeah. Great. These are the people in the leaderboard now. Let us move on to question number two. You guys are ready, all of you? Here we go. Question number two on your screens now. Faster, faster. Let's call back. Tokens are type of what? They are animals, crops, birds, reptiles. What are tokens? Can I ask you a simpler question than this? You guys tell me. Birds, right? Thousands of birds, guys. I hope you have not forgotten all what we dealt with in the, you know, in the lesson when I was handling this lesson. We spoke about tokens. Amarnath still at the top. I think Vanshika is at the number two. Sampurna number three. Sonali, Haifa Beta, Adit, top five. Shaurya, Bhavesh, Neil, Divyanshi, and Dikshita. Yes, Dikshita. Welcome back. Question number three on your screens. And the question Manioc food belongs to what? Manioc food. Which region? South America, South Africa, Amazon, Ganga Basin. Maniac. This is very tricky. Choose very wisely. How many of you chose South? South America. I know you, this make mistake you will have. It will happen. Many are food. Uh, you know you will see them throughout South America, not just in Amazon area alone. So, partly, you know, wrong, right? That that option. So South America is the right one in this case. So Neil at the top, followed by Divyanshi, Dikshita, Raman, Shagun, top five. Jolly Bolly, Solly Molly is six. Rohan, Haiveta, Shaurya, Ua, and Jai Saran. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Question 4. Here it is. Guys, after this, this is kind of fourth question. Only one more. Where do you see one horned rhinosaurs? Rhinoceros. Rhinoceros, one horned. Brahmaputra, Amazon, Gagra, none of these. Tricky, tricky, tricky. Don't blindly choose, think and choose. You have to remember. Mostly you need to know the answer. Otherwise, it's very difficult for you to write the correct one. So, how many of you chose option A, Brahmaputra? Guys, it is a feature of our Brahmaputra plane. One horned rhinoceros. So, four questions done. Neil about says, Neil is still at the top. Ah, uh, no, Divyanshi is at the top. Divyanshi, Neil, Ram, Dolly, Rohan, top five. Jai Saran, Mahima, Yo, Sampurna and Dikshita. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready? Final one. All of you ready? Come on, come on, come on. Let me see how many likes are coming. Huh? How clear you guys are. Come on, guys. Let me check that. Quick, 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 hit the like button. Let me know you liked it. If you have not, it's okay. It's a different thing. 
right ready for the final question here it is on your screens now hi atarva hello nagu kanwaljit in the ganga brahmaputra delta region bengal tigers crocodiles alligators are found is it true or false the delta region ganga brahmaputra the largest delta right do you really find bengal tigers crocodiles alligators true or false true yes guys we know these are these are the treasures of india the fauna found in that region so who's going to win looks like divyanshi or divyanshi it is by one point congratulations divyanshi neel ram great great job done divyanshi congrats i'm going to put your name in the leaderboard in telegram today the entire leaderboard i'll place there so neel ram uh, dolly hi jai saran top 5 oh top 6 in fact yeah sampurna bhavesh dikshita 6 7 8 9 10 guys everyone in the leaderboard great job done keep it up congrats i hope you enjoyed the quest whoever got the right answers kudos to all of you keep it up great job done so riddle for today you guys are ready what is the riddle first few people to answer the riddle right in the comment section i'll take your names people make me they save me change me raise me what am i people make me save me change me and raise me what am i first few people to answer the right ones correctly you know i'll take your names in the next session guys like this there are lovely lovely stuff happening in our telegram group and we pass all our vedantu young wonders related updates first to that group only so join our group all you have to do is put t.me/vedantujunior in your you know browser address bar and follow the instruction just get it installed and connect it All the best looking forward guys hit the like button let me know you liked it don't forget to share and subscribe to the channel thanks a lot i will catch up with all of you in the next session until then this is myself sundar rabindranath and signing off kids take care bye bye hello suhani hi ayush